Good afternoon, Camelot Knights. It's Mr. Cardenas here with your uh, weekly guidance lesson. A couple of changes. I'm gonna start sending you guys um, just the video resources uh, on Wednesdays. I realize that Mondays are kind of a busy day for you guys. You're either getting you're getting your new schoolwork for the week or you're finishing up last week's schoolwork. Uh, so I just figured I'd give you guys on Wednesday so you're able to, to kind of use this as a resource as you need it. Um, so that's the only thing I'm gonna be changing. I'll still be doing the Fridays um, stuff. Um, the fun Friday stuff on Fridays uh, as well. With that being said, guys, uh, we're gonna get into the lesson real quick. Uh, we're doing social emotional learning at home and we're focusing on growth and fixed mindset. Uh, so hopefully you guys had a chance to read the above slides, uh, the two slides, the video of the young, young man, Carson. Uh, it's a really good video uh, of him explaining what growth and fixed mindset is and how a couple of famous people, Michael Jordan and The Rock, um, kind of went through their struggles uh, and how they had personal or how they personally had a growth mindset and some of his own um, uh, things and how he uses it uh, um, daily. So um, it has a couple of activity questions for you guys to think about and ask yourselves after the video and also a little activity about um, trying to figure out what are those things that, that maybe you want to work on, uh, maybe some things that you're not so good at right now. Uh, that you can maybe work on uh, and it talks and he talks about the power of yet and we'll talk a little bit about that as well uh, so as you can see just next to me um, the slides here with the um, uh, I like to call them now fact sheets because they have a lot of good information on it yeah like I said you can print them and, and color them if you have if you have the means to do that uh, but it just kind of really talks about growth mindset and what it is we all know that uh, growth mindset is a is a belief that we have in ourselves and our abilities to do um, maybe tasks or, or um, things that are difficult. Um, we use words uh, with growth mindset like, um, you know, yeah, this is hard or this, this math question is hard, but I'm gonna practice and I'm gonna do my best to get better. That type of mentality as, a, as opposed to a fixed mindset where fixed mindset would say, you know, this math problem is way too hard. I'm not even gonna try. I quit, I give up. Um, I can't, the I quit, the, this is too hard, I'm, I, I'm not gonna do this. All those self-talks, uh, all those things you tell yourself, that's a fixed mindset. Uh, and we wanna kinda stay away from that. Again, with a growth mindset, we tell ourselves we can do this. Or maybe we realize, yeah, this is really hard, I can't do this yet. And that's where that power of yet comes in. Well, I can't do this yet, but if I practice hard, or if I study, if I um, take time to, to to ask questions to, to my teacher, I'm gonna be really, really good or I'm gonna be able to solve this math problem equation or whatever. And that only applies to, this doesn't only apply to just um, academics, which it's good for, but it applies to just everything that, you're, that you go through in life. Uh, sports, uh, maybe you're trying to learn an instrument, um, anything really, um, your schoolwork, um, your ability to, um, yeah, so those are things that, um, that's kind of the idea of a growth mindset and why we want to always kind of have one. In this little fact sheet, it talks a little bit about that. Um, it talks about some efforts and the challenges that we face and how, do, um, you know, how we can overcome those things. Uh, it talks about tips for dealing with frustration. Right now, you guys are probably having, um, you know, if you may have been feeling frustrated um, throughout this distant learning process with having all the work to, that you need to do. Um, you don't have that access to your teacher as freely as you did in the classroom. Uh, you have brothers and sisters um, that maybe need to use the computer as well, or maybe are bothering you while you're trying to do your work. Your, your parents are there as well. So it, it's just a, a situation that can cause a lot of frustration. So trying to figure out a way to think positive about, okay, well, what can I do to, to eliminate some of these distractions? What can I do to eliminate um, all the work piling up and, and doing those things? That, that's a good frame of um, lowering that frustration and having a positive mindset and a growth mindset. Uh, it also talks about mistakes and how you know we learn from our mistakes. So sometimes we get make a mistake and we think, well, we're never going to be good at anything. So we need to make sure that we change that mindset and that mistakes help us grow. If we're continuing to make the same mistakes over and over and over again, we're not learning from our mistakes and we're not growing. So we need to learn from our mistakes, grow from them, and become better from them, not worse. Uh, it talks a little bit about the power of yet and how how that's so powerful when we tell ourselves that and realize, look, I can't do this yet because I haven't put the time in, I haven't put the effort in, but once I do all those things, 
I'll be able to conquer this or, or complete this task. So that's important to think of too. Uh, and, it, and then it also kind of talks a little bit about just a thought process. We talked last week about ants, automatic um, negative thoughts and how those can be very, you know, th those can make us feel a certain way and, and cause us to feel a certain way. Well, it's the same thing here. We don't want to, we don't want those um, thoughts to play into our growth mindset because that, those are those are more things that are fixed mindset. Uh, the stewing we talked about stewing last week. Um, the mind reading, the the all in or nothing. All those things are kind of fixated towards. Uh, all those things are kind of go along with the fixed mindset. We want to stay away from that. So again, the positive self talk. The that's really big in having a growth mindset and your ability, and also surrounding yourself with people that believe in you too, and 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 encourage you to do well always helps as well. So that's kind of just the gist of the growth and fixed mindset, guys. Uh, if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact me either through Google Classroom or if you, you guys have my number um, on, on the guidance lessons link. So you can give me a call there. I'm available to you guys. If you have any questions about the lesson, if you just want to talk, um, whatever the case may be. With that being said, guys, you're going to have a great rest of your week. Uh, we'll talk to you guys next Wednesday uh, with our next lesson and uh, look forward to, um, to, to visiting with you guys. You guys take care, stay safe. We'll see you next week. Bye-bye.